Sebastian Korda versus Karin Hashinov is the first quarter final for the men at the Australian Open for 2023. And both guys have had tough matches to get to this stage. Korda started the tournament off as the number 29 seed and would take on Garin in the first round. And after dropping the second set, Korda would get through in 4, 6 4, 1 6, 6 3, 6 2. In the second round, he'd take on the qualifier Watanuki. And after a close second set, Korda would get through in 3, 6 2, 7 5, 6 4. In the third round, he'd take on the number 7 seed Medvedev, who had been to the final the two previous Australian Opens. After a first set that went to a tie break, Korda would eventually prevail in straights, 7-6, 6-3, 7-6. In the fourth round, he would take on the number 10 seed, Hubi Hercatch, who was coming off two five setters in his previous matches. And after dropping the first set, Korda would have to come back for the first time this tournament, eventually prevailing in a fifth set tie break, 3-6, 6-3, 6-2, 1-6, 7-6, to advance to his first Grand Slam quarterfinal. Ashinov started the tournament off as the number 18 seed and would take on Morales in the first round. And after a first set that went to a tie break, he got through in straights, 7-6, 6-2, 6-love. In the second round, he'd take on the wildcard Kubler. And after playing a 70-shot rally and dropping the second set, Ashinov got through in four, 6-4, 5 7 6 4 6 2. In the third round, he'd take on the number 16 seed Tiafo, who was looking very, very strong. But Hashinov dismissed him in 4 6 3 6 4 3 6 7 6. In the fourth round, Hashinov would take on the number 31 seed Nishioka, and this was by far the easiest match of Hashinov's tournament. Double bageling in the first two sets to prevail in 3 6 love, 6 love, 7 6 to get to another Grand Slam quarterfinal. These two guys have played three times before with quarter leading the head-to-head 2-1, -head having won both their matches in 2022. But the last time they played at a slam was a five-set epic that Hashinov won at Wimbledon back in 2021. If Korda's going to win this match, he's going to have to serve well and he's going to have to keep that variety. We saw it against Medvedev. He came to the net, hit a lot of good shots at the net, but he didn't do that as much against her catch, which is why the match was so extended compared to the Medi match. If Hashinov is going to win this one, he just needs to be consistent. He is pretty much a grind on the baseline at some points. He's not really like your typical big man, big serving guy. He does have those things, but he does like to grind out the rallies and he's going to have to do that if he's going to beat Korda. This is a very interesting matchup because a lot of people thought that we're going to get Medvedev versus Rafa in this quarter final. Instead, we've got a couple of random guys, but I'm going to go with Korda. I think he's inspired this week. His dad won this tournament 25 years ago and I feel like it's his time to shine and get to his first semifinal. But let me know down in the comments below. Who do you think is going to win this match?